Hello guys, welcome to another episode of Sports Updates Ghana. It's your boy Joseph Adama Fioen. Coming up in the update, Ghanaian boxer Richard Comey suffered around 11 technical knockout defeats to American boxer that is Jose Ramirez in their super lightweight contest which took place in the United States of America in California to be precise. So I have all the updates and just on how Richard Comey ended up losing the fight in round 11. We want to stick and stay as I bring you up to speed on that before we get into it please subscribe to the channel if you haven't like share and don't forget to leave a comment so let's get right into it and Ghanaian super lightweight boxer that is Richard Comey suffered around 11 10 count knockouts to United States of America boxer that is Jose Ramirez in their fight that took place earlier on today on Sunday March 26th so Richard Comey was looking forward to inch closer to getting a WBC world title shot at the age of 36 but unfortunately he was unable to win the bout and has now crashed his hopes of becoming a two-time world champion Richard Comey was a former IBF world champion but unfortunately he lost that title to Teofimo Lopez and since then he hasn't been the same. He got a big fight against Vasily Lomachenko and lost that bout. But let's talk about this bout. How did Richie Komi end up losing this fight against Jose Ramirez? So it all started in round one when Ramirez set the ball rolling with powerful shots, which left Richie Komi in a very difficult and bad position after the first round. However, Richie Komi kept on holding on to his right hook in round two and the American boxer kept on firing with his persistent punches and never gave Richard Comey a uh, space to even breathe and was always throwing the punch. So Ramirez was tough on Richard Comey in the earlier rounds. However, in the third round, there was a big sigh of hope for Richard Comey as he switched up the fight, scoring big points in the third round. Despite the shot from Comey, Ramirez remained relentless as he kept on the pressure and give little room for Richard Comey to land a clean punch in round three. Still in the third round, the 28-year-old American boxer walked into a combination of punches from Richard Comey which forced him to clinch to Richard Comey and unfortunately, Richard had to go to the rules. Well, in the fourth round and fifth round, Richard Comey was unable to keep up with his good work and it was Ramirez who came all guns blazing in the fourth and fifth round as he ended up landing some good shots at the former IBF champion. The latter round, which was in round six, seven, eight, and nine, was a little dull and it wasn't full of action packed as both boxers were looking a little bit fatigued after giving their all in the first five rounds. However, in round 11, that was where all the action unfolded, and that was where Richard Comey was dropped to the canvas after Ramirez landed a good hook. On his face and Richard Comey was unable to stand to his feet and ended up rolling on the ground. Well, we all thought that that was going to be the end of Richard Comey in the bout and Ramirez was going to win the fight by a knockout. But unfortunately, or fortunately for Richard Comey, he was able to beat the referee's count and continue the bout. But Richard Comey wasn't the same after he was able to uh, rise up in the 11th round. Well. Ramirez, saying that Comey was weak, ended up throwing more punches at Comey and Comey was unable to stand to the uh, punches of Ramirez and ended up clinging to the American boxer and sent him to the ropes, which saw Richard Comey nearly flying out of the ring. Yes, his, half of his body was out of the ring when he and Ramirez fell to the ground in round 11. It was just three minutes of boxing in round 11, but Richard Comey showed so much that uh, we all knew that he wasn't going to win that bout after all. So uh, the two boxers got back to their feet and Ramirez kept on piling pressure on Comey and sent him to the ropes and this time he started working on the body of Richard Comey. Richard Comey was able to uh, stand to the punches of Ramirez but one punch that landed on the stomach ended 
up getting Richard Comey on his knees and this time he wasn't able to beat the count of the referee so the referee had to end the bout in round 11 and that was how Richard Comey lost the bout it was a technical knockout Richard Comey bowing on the ground or uh, kneeling taking a knee after he got a punch on his stomach and he wasn't able to continue the bout so the referee ended up ruling the victory in favor of Jose Ramirez who has now inched closer to getting a world title fight so Richard Comey at the age of 36 has suffered his fifth career defeat in 36 career fights. Richard Comey has fought 36 fights, has 30 wins, 5 defeats and 1 draw. Out of the 30 wins he has, he has managed 27 by way of knockout and out of his 5 defeats Richard Comey has suffered two knockouts when you add this knockout to the knockout he suffered in the past that was to robert easter jr uh, he currently has two knockout defeats out of his five career defeats so richard comey losing his fight to you see ramirez over there since the year 2021 richard comey has never been the same and he suffered a defeat to vasily lomachenko back in 2021 which was a unanimous decision he went ahead to fight you see Pedrez before this fight in 2022 and that ended up in a draw and currently he has lost to you see ramirez so in his last three fights richard comey has not won a bout well Richard Comey won um, uh, the IBF lightweight title back uh, in the year, I think, 2019, when he defeated Issa Chavez in that bout to win that particular title. Unfortunately, after managing to um, defend his title once, he ended up losing that IBF title to Teofimo Lopez, I think, back in 2020 it didn't even take long for richard comey to lose his title it didn't even take one year but all the same richard comey has been able to make a good amount of money from this fight after losing to you say ramirez richard comey got five hundred thousand dollars for losing the bout to you see Ramirez, that is a good amount of money if you ask me. How many boxers can fight and get $500,000 from pay-per-view? Well, Richard Comey has been able to do it. He got a nice amount of money when he got uh, he fought um, Vasily Lomachenko. That was $750,000 back in 2021 and got about 350000 pay-per-view uh, earnings from that fight from uh, 2021 as well. So Richard Comey, Charlie, the guy is dusted, and I know the Ghana Boxing Authority will definitely be coming for the account from this one. But the two uh, entities have some grudge, and we'll see how that one goes. And I'll be bringing you up to speed on all that. But until then, this has been another episode of Sports Update Ghana. Richard Comey losing by around 11 technical knockouts to you see Ramirez in the United States of America. Share your thoughts in the comment section. Please like and don't forget to share the video so, so that your family and friends can get to know about sports update Ghana. and most importantly please subscribe see you in the next one